Hey, what's going on everybody? It's your boy named Matthews. I'm back again with another review. This time, we're going to review something from Angeles Direct, one of the fastest shipping companies. I ordered from like three or four different companies this past week, um, Angeles Direct being one of the last of them, but it's one of the first items I received. So shout out to Angeles Direct for the fast shipping, and also shout out to Sneakerhead in the Bay for letting me use his discount code that he was promoting on his videos. Um, I got the uh, starter kit from Angeles Direct. $26.95 plus shipping and everything. I saved $2.70 using Sneakerhead in the Base code. So for a total of $31, I'm going to show you guys what I got. Ripped open the uh, ripped open the box already, but I'm going uh, to show you guys what's inside right now. First up, we got a brush for cleaning the shoes. And this is going to come in handy because I ordered, um, or not ordered, I purchased from the store the Mark Jason or Jason Mark, whatever it's called. I purchased that shoe cleaner. Um, you get a lot more shoe cleaner if you just buy the bottle straight up. So I bought the bottle by itself without the without the brush. So I really needed a brush, so this is gonna come in handy. So there we go, got a brush right there. Another thing we got is the Easy Cleaner. This right here is for cleaning suede, leather, buck, rubber, linen, and some other stuff. Huh, you guys can see the bottle there. And this is like a, a, a lot of cleaning solution for the value too. Um, the Jason Mark one, forget the ounces, but the bottle definitely looks a lot smaller and it costs like $10. This one, if I'm correct, this on the website, Angeles Direct website, costs like 3 or $4 for this bottle. So we got that there. Um, what else we got in here? We have the matte acrylic finisher. Hopefully you guys can see this. This is going to be used for after you do the customs on your shoes. You paint this over. It's going to help the design last a lot longer. So we got that. We got some leather prepare and deglazer. This is what you're going to use before you start a custom to get some of that extra paint off and some of the wax that's covering the current design that the shoes came with. So this is going to be straight up like acetone. If you don't want to purchase this off the website, seeing that some other people just use straight acetone, it's going to do the same thing. It's probably what that is anyway. Um, I got a set of four paint brushes in order to do the custom. And last but not least, I got the paint. Now these paint things are a lot smaller than I expected, but it's going to get the job done. So this is a one ounce container of Angelus white paint. It's gonna be for painting the leather. There it goes with the white. Also got the same size in a black. And for the color, I got fire red. Hopefully you guys can see that. So yeah, for a total of $30, this is what I ordered. Um, I'm going to go ahead and custom some shoes, customize some shoes. Um, this is going to be my first time doing it like this. I used to, back in the day, back in high school, we used to just get the canvas shoes, you know, cheap shoes from Walmart, get the fabric paint, and just write out the tube, just paint on the shoes, do little zigzags, different designs, write some words on them and stuff like that. So, um, this is definitely not new, but I haven't done it in a long time, so I really hope I don't mess up, but, um, you guys, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to decide which ones are going to be the first one. These are the ones I think I'm going I'm to do. Probably paint these red, paint them black, and do do all kinds of different stuff. Because these shoes are real comfortable. But if you guys could tell at the bottom there, right there in the corner, um, the paint is coming off. And the color is fading and stuff on these. But they're still in good condition, meaning no holes. The bottoms are still good. They're not all jacked up or nothing like that. So I just want to keep these alive, bring them back to life, you know. So I might be doing a customization on this guys got any ideas let me know so either on this i was gonna set this on my table I ain't gonna do that so it's gonna either be out of this shoe and this is a nike air assault by the way if you guys like this shoe or i'm gonna do a custom on these air force ones these air force ones are also in great condition um the soles are kind of yellowing there i never even really wear these shoes i don't know why they're just not one of my favorites in the collection, but there still are some great shoes, excellent condition. I can definitely start off by brightening those soles back up, or the midsole. And um, yeah, 
I'm about to get to work on these shoes. And you guys wish me luck. If you guys found this video helpful in any way, hit that thumbs up button. Let me know what you guys are doing. And show me some of you guys' custom videos. Give me some ideas. Hit me up on Instagram at NDM, the number nine, and the word one spelled out. This is NDM91. You can find all my links in the description. Subscribe to the page, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.